Today we're going to go over Lakewinds fiber to the home interfaces. This is a ONT enclosure. And normally you can find it close to your, your power meter on the side of the home. Um, there is a screw in the middle here, just a standard screwdriver, to open this box. Once you open the box, you'll find uh, a number of wires in here. There is the wire that goes to line one, that'll be your phone wire. If you have multiple lines, line two will be your second line in the home. Uh, Ethernet one is gonna be designated for internet, and Ethernet two is gonna be designated for LCTV if you have that service. RF video. On the bottom here is a coax connector. Um, that's if you're subscribed to our TV service. There's also lights on this, this card. The power and transport light have to be on and solid. The off hook light, if you have a phone that's off hook, that light will be on. A CPU light, that's gonna flash on and off, pretty steady. Uh, on battery light, if that light is on, your battery is on battery backup, so it doesn't have power to the, the ONT battery. And then the RF video, that light will be active if you're subscribed to our TV series. All you do to simply check the dial tone is unplug the test jack, take your test phone, simply plug it in, and check for dial tone. If there is no dial tone, call us and we can come out and troubleshoot. If you do have the dial tone, the trouble would be in your home. Uh, it's up to you to troubleshoot yourself or we can come out and troubleshoot for you. When you're done checking, be sure to plug this back in. Uh, line two, if you have two lines, do the same thing. Uh, the ethernet, you can just unplug the ethernet cable. Plug an ethernet cable in to test your internet. When you're done, just be sure and get everything put back in here. And you'll hear the, the cover snap in two spots. And then also be sure to tighten this screw. 